Hello. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use GIFs in Google Forms. And the reason I'm putting I've put together this this broadcast for today is that uh, one of the teachers I work with has uh, used GIFs uh, in a very sort of thoughtful way. Uh, GIFs are short for Graphics Interchange Format, and what we see here is uh, with this teacher that's used them. Um, he has a Google Form. He's kind of using this like an assessment, which Google Forms can be used for. But if you look down here, instead of a static image. Uh, he uses GIFs, and these are really, uh, I think, a really, really great use of technology in action because uh, the, the GIFs just play over and over, and it's a very short snippet of basketball positioning, and uh, this is a lot more effective than, I think, just traditional YouTube video because you have to, like, play a video, and then you get to the end, you have to play it again. Whereas these things are just constantly running. Uh, there's also a little title slide on all of this. So the teacher here is asking, uh, you know, what is the best position and has, you know, has a corresponding question. So a really cool use of using GIFs. Um, so what I'd like to do is kind of show you how to do this uh, because it is quite easy. Uh, find a section of video that you would like to do. In this case, I have some paramecium's that are... Uh, obviously running around under the microscope and this is a Creative Commons licensed image so I think it's okay to use. I'm just going to grab that and there's a lot of GIF creators but I'm going to go to Jiffy and I'm going to go to create. You don't even have to log in and once that's done it's going to ask you for uh, what movie do you have on your dashboard or um, YouTube video and I'm just going to paste this in here and now that that's done I'm going to do that and the duration of the video is right around here about between 140 and 150 so I'm going to go here and I'm just going to have a four second GIF uh, I'm going to go in here to about 143 and I'm going to say continue the next thing it will ask you is if you want to for example put a caption over it uh, in this case I don't want to I'm just going to use that and then I'm going to uh, well, once it finally uploads here um, but if you want to put like a little caption at the bottom or the top, uh, you can just can do that. I'm not going to do this. I'm just going to go to continue to upload. And now that I've done that, uh, this is basically my source URL. But I'm just going to upload to Jiffy. And once I do that, it'll give me a shortened URL, a full URL, and then from that I can paste it in a Google form. So. Um, it's quite easy. There's a lot of these already on GIF sites that you guys can use. But uh, now that it's done, uh, I can now get my link. So I'm just copying my link. And there you go. And once that's done in a Google Form, when I go over here, I can go to uh, add a video. And I'm just going to go add a video to my URL. Paste that in there. Oh, sorry. Wrong place. Sorry. I put it in as an image before. So by URL, and there we go. And now that's done, it'll load the preview, and you just uh, select it, and bada bing. So um, now that I have my form, I can uh, take a look at the image that I've uh, installed there, and uh, it just plays. And I can ask some questions about it, ask uh, about, for example, what the paramecium's behavior is, uh, how they're working together, and it's a lot more effective than a static image or a YouTube video. So I hope you enjoyed, and happy Googling.